What's going on everybody, Deacon here, and I just have a simple question as you could tell by the title of the video, and that is, has being the bigger person in every situation benefited you every single time? And then the part two to that question is, is it wrong to not want to be the bigger person in a situation? And the reason for that question is I think about certain situations I deal with, whether it be with coworkers, relatives, whatever the case may be, or just some random person that you know I meet that we might have a disagreement because maybe somebody couldn't decide who wanted to go in line first or something like that. But it always makes me wonder sometimes, and just to be honest, it sucks sometimes having to be the bigger person and to be the person to always have to initiate something or try to resolve something. Now, don't get me wrong. If I am 100% at fault and I'm the person who caused the rift or the issue, then absolutely I should be the bigger person and step forward because I was the one that caused it or was the one that made the situation what it is. But if it's something where we just had a disagreement or it was just lack of communication, miscommunication, that Sometimes I don't feel like being the person to have to go forward all the time. And, and as I get older, it just feel like sometimes I don't feel like putting in that time and that energy and just be like, you know what? I just don't want to deal with it. And it just is what it is. So, I mean, it makes me wonder, like I said, this is just a random question of something I was thinking of. I had a totally different video plan, but after certain events came up in a certain conversation that I had with my wife, it just made me think to myself like, man, when it comes to just dealing with individuals and dealing with people, I understand that the type of relationship you have with that person will determine how much time and effort you try to put to make sure that things are good. But at the same time, I don't like putting in that type of energy with people that I constantly have to do that all the time. And it's one sided. If it's a situation where I know that the other party is going to put in just as much effort to resolve a situation as I would, then Sometimes I would be the person to just go ahead and initiate it to try to figure out what's going on. But as I get older, sometimes it just, it just feels like it's not worth it. There are some people I would definitely be the bigger person and step forward and do what needs to be done. But then there are others who are just like, hey, you know, my, you know where I live or you know my phone number. You got my email. You know how to get in contact with me. I hear from you when I hear from you. But that's it. That's it. Please leave any comments in the comment section below because I'm, I'm curious about that because should it always be because I'm the mature one or if you're the mature one in a situation that you should be always the first one to try to be the bigger person to resolve an issue or should it be a mutual thing where sometimes they might have to step forward. I'm curious to know what you think. Leave your comments in the comment section below. But as always, be wise. And until I see you all next time, have a great day.